Yo, CFC Riddus Blue back with another video, and this is my Tottenham vs Chelsea Carabao Cup semi final second leg player rating video. Player ratings, man, it's a good performance. Um, let's start with Kepa in goal. Kepa, my guy, you made you made some good decision saves and some good saves, especially the one at the end. That just before the um, the game ended, and also the one to, to um, deny Emerson Royal from scoring that was a good um, that was a good save, and then also making a good decision to come out and stop um, Lucas Moura. And like I said, they tried to say that would be a penalty, but it clearly wasn't. It was just great goalkeeping from you. It was a good performance, man. I'm happy with you. But the levels you've been showing consistently. It's been calm still, I can't complain. It's, it's, this is what we need. Reliable and trustworthy goalkeeper. Just until Edward Mendy comes back, you know what I'm trying to say. So, just a good performance from you, man. My rating for you today, I'm going to award you with a, with a seven. Had a good game. Good game. And then, move on to our defenders. Andres Christensen. Hey. Calm, calm performance from you. Calm performance. Um, I was looking a little shaky. If I'm honest, looking a little shaky. Obviously, the Tottenham are getting a lot of chances, but obviously they didn't they didn't score and just had um just had a very average performance. Like I said in the second half, um in the match review I said in the um, in the second half we were just on cruise control and you came off in the 66 minutes so um. Just had a very calm performance. Like I said, get a clean sheet. That means a lot. So yeah, man. Um, your rating I'm gonna give you is a. I'm gonna give you a six. I'm gonna give you a six. You know, five point five. Was just, just a calm, average performance. Nothing too major, if I'm honest with you. And then we have Antonio Rudiger. Actually, sorry, Milan saw. That's what we're gonna do next. Milan saw my guy. You had a very good performance. You looked very calm and composed. Lovely long balls, not making any bad decisions. But obviously, just being um, yeah, just being just getting a little out of place and and Tottenham just getting in behind a little bit. But obviously, other than that, you had a very solid performance. I'm just happy to know that you've been having back to back games where you've been having solid performances, whether it's against Chesterfield or Tottenham. Um, it's very good to see you play in the, in the way that Chelsea play and to keep clean sheets and to just be very solid at the back is key for them because like I said um, before Chelsea need their whole squad and you are a part of that play a big part in that and I'm happy with your performance today my rating for you I'm going to give you is a 7 you had a very good performance man happy with it Hope the form continues, Alonso. And then we move on to Antonio Rudiger, the goal scorer, the winner, the winner of the match for us, and who sent us to the Carabao Cup final. Man, just complete ease. Other than obviously the challenge on Huebia, uh, everyone thought that was a penalty at first, but obviously looking back at the replay, it was rightly given as a, a second. I mean. A free kick so just calm defending from you Kane wasn't on nothing like that he barged into the ground and like I said you always love you always love to make defend I mean attackers unsettled so you did that again today top them on, on anything major you had a very calm performance man very calm performance my rating for you I'm going to give you an eight Today, I would say that he was the man of the match for us. The match winner is looking very calm at the back. Obviously, getting the clean sheet as well. So, yeah, my rating for you is an A. You are my man of the match today, Antonio Rudiger. And then we move on to um, our left wing back, Marcus Alonso. Mar Wait, sorry. Callum, Callum hudson Day played left wing back today. My bad. Callum had um, a calm game. Nothing... Too major. I wish you um, you can just take more shots and just have better connections with them to test the keeper better. But 
and you see it's just it just wasn't that day to day uh, it was chest to food so it just is what it is my rating for you how to sit bed i'm gonna give you today is a i'm gonna give you 6.5 um calm average game nothing too major so yeah it's very calm let me move on to our right wing back El Captain Cesar Aspilicueta obviously just leading by example setting the tone for the match oh, I've been up and ready for it which always always can count on SP to make good performances and put his 100% in for the team especially if the cup final is on the line right, just a hard hard footballer um, very calm performance today um, nothing too too major. My rating for you is a. I'm gonna give you a, a six point five. Calm, calm performance. And then we move on to the midfield. Jorginho, who on that Jorginho J five. I can say it's about the whole team. Um, realistically, other than uh, for the rest of our. Midfield and attack is just very calm performances in the second half and in the first half we could have scored let's say one more chance one more goal but it wasn't it wasn't as convincing obviously as the first as the first leg but that's just because we went out to the first leg to make sure that in the second leg we didn't have to put in enough energy because we know that we're playing Man City on the weekend and that's where we're putting a lot more energy into our game knowing even though Tuchel said that Obviously, we are, but we, we don't have one for in the final. He knew that we really did, I believe so. It's like, I believe that he was already in the final before today. So, yeah, it's like, you know, like Jorginho just had a calm performance, just doing his thing. It got taken off in the second half. Um, There's nothing too major. My rating for you, Jorginho, is a... I'm gonna give you a 6.5, just calm, calm performance. And then Mateo Kovacic, my guy. And like I said, another calm performance, nothing too major. You're just doing your thing, winning balls, driving with the ball, attacking, attacking Tottenham. But nothing too major, we're only 1 1 0. So we're just saving energy for Man City in my opinion because there was nothing there was nothing out nothing outstanding so just a calm average performance I rate for you is a 6.5 or so and then we move on to our attackers Mason Mount um not that great of a performance for you can't even lie um he didn't really do too much. Obviously, you got the assist. You got the assist. Obviously, standard procedure. But other than that, it wasn't nothing too major. And obviously, like like I say, I just get the feeling that we're just saving all this energy for Man City. Um, like if there if, if there was still a game to be won, i.e., if Tottenham had a chance to try and get back into the game to take us the extra time or to go through. The energy levels would have been much higher, especially for Mal. So, see, knowing that his level, his energy levels wasn't the highest as it normally is, just lets me know that at least we, everyone thought that we was gonna go through already. So, especially after we scored the goal, so it was clearly cleared up from then. And Mal, your rating I'm gonna give you is a, I'm gonna give you a seven. Calm performance and then we have my guy Timo Werner Timo <sighs> nothing too major man nothing too major getting in behind doing the runs but just obviously just not getting the goals um it's a calm average performance man realistically can't really say too much there wasn't nothing as ordinary um, my rating for you that I'm gonna give you is a that I'm gonna give you a six point five also. I'm gonna give you a six point five. 
and then we have Romelu Lukaku, Big Rom. Well, hey, you could that was a good save from the Tottenham goalkeeper, but I feel like you should have definitely scored in the first half. For me, you should have, but obviously this wasn't meant to be. Other than that, I didn't really see you do much for the rest of the game. Like you was you was good physically for the team, making making bringing players in and whatnot, but. Like I said, we only scored one goal and in the second half we didn't look threatening at all. Like we was just gonna allow Tottenham to attack us and not really do too much in the attacking third. Like we just gonna wasn't trying to waste any energy. So yeah man, it's just a calm performance. You could have scored but you didn't. We can hope that you scored in City on Saturday, but we shall see. Other than that, my rating for you today, I'm going to give you a 6.5 also but yeah um, calm performance and then we move on to the substitutes first of all Thiago Silva coming on making say the back line more stable but obviously Tottenham getting in behind a couple of times um didn't play for that long played literally less than let's say about 40 minutes to include at a time um just calm Marshalling defence, doing your thing, making sure that we go through to the Carabao Cup final. Come not allowing Tottenham to score. That is excellent, man. That is excellent. My rating for you is a six. Thiago Silva, give you a six today. And then we move on to our other substitutes. We have Kai Havertz. So, okay, well, um, can I have a smile, guy? Well, hey, interesting, interesting. I'm not gonna lie, I don't think it was kind of nice. Sorry, it wasn't even can I have a smile, but my team it was. Hakim Ziyech that came in next. Man, it's weird. Um, Hakim Ziyech, but hey, no, nothing too major. My rating for you, I'm going to give you, is a, is a, I'm going to give you a 5.5. Also, of our other substitute that came on, Marcus Alonso, I'm going to give you a 5.5. And then, our other substitutes, Angola Kante, I'm not going to give you a rating, didn't come on and do too much, didn't have long enough on the pitch, I'm not going to get a rating. And Ruben off the cheek, you came on only about 10, 15 minutes remaining. Nothing too major, I'm not going to give you a rating either like that. So then after that, we have Thomas Tuchel, T2. You didn't ask to another cup final, man. My rare few is a nine. You make the team um, burn out the energy levels before Man City. You handled the game well. You used us into the Carabao Cup final without having to put any real effort in. It's a calm, calm performance. And now we just have to look forward to Man City, Manchester City on the weekend. So it's going to be interesting. Hopefully you win that game, can close the gap somewhat. But I said, Thomas Tupi, you a rating, I was a man. Chelsea are in the Carabao Cup, sent the Carabao Cup final. Back at Wembley, we'll be playing there at some point in the near future against either Arsenal or Liverpool. So we're going to find out who we play and whoever we play, let's beat them. Come on, Chelsea. You know what we do. I'm CFC Riddles Blue. Please subscribe, like, and um, share. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace. I'm out. Come on, Chelsea.